Hey you guys, Captain McAdam here with my husband, John. With all the news fit to ignore. Okay. So. You were saying. Right. <laughs> anyway, we recently had gotten a package from my friend, Me 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 Art. <laughs> me 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 Art. Now. She's from Norway. So, when she was home for the holidays, her and her family, very nice, had gathered stuff for us. They made lists. I said lists. Plural. Like, I'm like, oh, lists. Wait, wait, that's plural. Why'd you send me? <laughs> Puppy? No. No growling. Puppy being a grumpy. He's being grump. So, for this video, we're trying two things of the same type, but they're different brands and they're made different, and they're in different forms. What are these things? In English, it is brown cheese. I agree with the dog. Ah, <laughs> uh, they're actually. I read a little bit of the process. They're made of goat's milk. Which is a little less um, lactose than most normal types of milk, so... I mean, the process is a little different, but it is made from goat. No, I mean, goat's milk is, has a lot less lactose than cow's milk. Yep. So it's a little more tolerable for those that are lactose intolerant. There you go. Depending on your level of severity. For example, me. Like, a shot glass full of milk sends me screaming to the bathroom. It's not fun. It's not. It's not pleasant. So, and I did read a little bit more into it, um, because there's different, mostly it's, t it's tended to be eaten on bread. Okay. But I read more into it because in case I just didn't want to do bread, it can also be eaten on crisp bread. Oh, is it the return of these? Are you breaking these back out? Yes, I am. The ones that we had tried before, the... Thin crisp breads? Yeah. Yes, because we still have them. We're going to try it on them. Both different ones, because we still have the seas. Both of them are sea salt, but one is sesame seeds and one is rosemary. So. Oh, snap. Here we go. Bring these back, and I like these. So, first ones of the form we're trying is... Oh, my God. Anyway. <laughs> Sorry, something came up, and I had to read it. First one is this one. Typically, it's in bricks. So, you know what it allows us to do? Because I saw that it, that they use one of these, and I was happy the fact that we have one. <laughs> it's pre-sliced. But I still have one! Okay, 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 okay. Put the cheese cutter down. We don't need you to cut the cheese. No, that's your job. <laughs> So, anyway, uh, hey, knock it off. Uh, anyway. Uh, are you done? Never. Stop throwing your cheese around. Tell me how many. Okay, so I don't remember which cracker is which, so this is going to be fun for both of us. Would you like me to pick out which one's which? Although I think this one's a sesame. Yeah. Okay, so. Super sniffer. Yep. Super tista. Time to take a look. Super smart ass. Yes, you are. Okay. Super squicked out. Oh, jeez, it's just the color. That's how they're supposed to look. I know, an adult. I will admit, my impressions are colored by my American upbringing. Fully, completely. I will be the first to admit it. I will also be the first to admit, I like to think... That I have tried enough foods across the, that have come from across the world that I'm willing to try all these new things. That looks weird. Will I eat it? Yes, that looks weird. And see, I was in a home where I was raised old. So trying new things wasn't exactly in the agenda growing up. Which is why I love trying new things all the time. <laughs> no matter how weird they are. You know, weird too, you know. Americans. 
but I love it. <laughs> so, which means, in other words, marrying me is like the highest point of your life because I'm always introducing you to new and weird foods. Mm, and I also love you because I love you. That's all about the new and weird foods. Anyway, I will go ahead and take the broken one. Okay. You know me. Hey, that wasn't nice. Yeah, that's what you said. Anyway, so um, I read other things that you could eat on crisp bread with strawberry jam. This was strawberry jam. Yeah, but I want to try it as it is first. But I'm gonna grab the strawberry jam after this anyway. Okay, so ready? No. The texture is like eating Velveeta. Or an American cheese slice. Yeah. Flavor is wholly and completely unoffensive. Because there isn't really that much of a flavor. But that's okay. Indeed it is. I could literally do this as a snack when I'm working late at night because <laughs> I'm always I like to snack when I'm either streaming or I'm working on stuff. Honestly, that's what I foresee happening to it. I can see me just taking crisps, cheese. There's my snack. So yeah, I read. I read that. Other than bread, you can eat on crisp bread with strawberry jam. This is not the first time that I've heard about being able to do this, so... Also, they've done it on... I've read that they can do it on waffles. Because in the morning, I'm making waffles. No, we're not. There you go. Sadly. Hmm. Actually, that's not terrible. Ooh. No, it's not. I like it. Hmm. Yeah, not bad. Hmm. All right. You win this round, but we have one more round to go. Now, it is still brown cheese, but it is spreadable version. I'll get another knife. Well, we got one. I planned ahead. You can use that knife as a screwdriver. <laughs> <laughs> now nah, we're, we're, we're just that level of redneck. Oh, yeah, we probably did. I'm probably going to see it now. Yeah. Our family is just that level of redneck. <laughs> just a little. Right. It's called, hold up, no, I'm over you. It's called the Prim. Original 8% fat. Prim, 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 prim. Ingredients milk, fat, zero grams. Yeah, normally I would try to translate that, but. My brain's not functioning, cooperating, enough. and it's about the same color. No, it's peanut butter color. <laughs> it's it looks like peanut butter, but it's not. And all of a sudden, you are squicked out. Yeah, it's that. Okay, it said it's typically a thin layer, so. Just enough. Let us know if that's... Oh, that's Ooh. right. Well, let me see if I can... There we go. Yeah, much better. Let us know if that's a little too thin. You want me to put more on it? No. I'm just saying, those who know this, let us know if that's too thin. Well, either way, I put it just a little thicker for my own slice. Gonna close that back up. I hope this tastes good because, again, snackage.
Don't have the smell to it. Not really. Probably does, but mm. even what I can't even smell for once. Okay. Sweet. It actually, and this is a rosemary. This is the one that I don't think you like. Nope. But it tastes good on it. It's sweet, yeah. I've wanted to br try brown cheese for a while since Mimi Me R told me about it. I just could never afford to get it. It's on Amazon, but it's a little expensive just to buy one small package. So that's why it took me so long. So thank you for sending me brown cheese in both forms. I enjoyed both. Surprisingly, so did I. Okay, so with that said, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to see more of these, hit the subscribe button. And if you want to know when these come out, hit that bell and make it ring. We are also on social medias, such as Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Check out the merch. And our merch. Links are in the description below. You can mostly find me. If you find me, you can find this one. With that said, again, thank you, Mimi Me R, for sending me this. I know we got a lot more videos to do because she sent me. The box is ridiculous. A whole lot of stuff, and I look forward to trying it all. So. The box is ridiculous. Till next time, you guys. Bye. And that's the way it is.